Hey there, what is up, Wizards Mesh Cap 1? Doing some more Toppling Singe gameplay. Uh, very excited about this one. We actually got first blood off camera. Um, I did start poison to proxy, but the gangplank ended up face checking us when we were uh, three stacked in a bush and we just DPS'd him down. He still has a uh, teleport and flash up. He didn't actually blow that, but nice little free early push because he died. So, purpose of today's video is to show you guys that I'm going to be trying out some, uh, I talked about this a bit on stream um, when I was playing on the on the Master Grandmaster account, but basically top lane, people have been complaining a lot about top lane. And the reason why they're complaining a lot about top lane is because they feel that top lane has like no agency. That, that That's the issue that people feel. And by agency, they, they mean um, ability to impact the game. Now, the problems that people have with that is that they feel like they can like get ahead in top lane, but it doesn't really matter because they don't actually get any benefit from getting ahead in top lane. They just, like, sort of are irrelevant. Um, and yeah, you know, I'll admit, I have felt a little bit of this with Singed as well. Uh, we're actually gonna execute this. I don't have enough mana to push this third wave, but it's fine. I, I have felt this a little bit with, uh... There's Echo coming. With the Singed as well, where a lot of the time it feels like, you know, I can't really have that much game impact. And I and I was doing this a bit on stream as well before, when I was running, um... I oh, repeat to see it. All right, wave hit tower, let's go. Broke the freeze a little bit. You can do that, by the way, to, uh, to push the wave in. But that's part of the reason, the reason why people are feeling low impact is because top lane has just been removed from a lot of the map this season with the uh, with the teleport changes. So, can I all in this game plank? I do have uh, Predator Boots if Lily wants to come. But that is a okay if she does not either. So we're gonna try and rectify this a bit, and I was running this on stream for a while. But we're doing, uh, we're doing Moonstone builds. He's off. He has Flash still, but I think we're fine. Very nice, gotta run from the Echo. Oh. He does not actually kill her. Got his Flash, nice. Help me shove. Very nice. Wait, no. <laughs> I got the angry Annie. I wanted, the, I wanted the thumbs up. That's okay. That is completely okay. Yeah, so I've been running Moonstone on stream. Come on, bleed. Nice. I got the... Oh, I got the assist. What? No way I get the assist for that. Are right, we going to go uh, Swifties here? Ah, am I going to go Swifties? I'm not going to go Swifties here. We're going to do Amp Tome. I've been running Moonstone on stream, and I guess if, uh, if you guys have been watching the stream, I haven't actually been on the stream the last few days because of the Spectrum Internet, the worst ISP in the country. Um, in this country, I can say. Not the country, obviously, it's this country. Um, but I've been going Moonstone, and I've had, like, pretty okay results. I think there's ways to make it better than what I've been doing. So in this, this game, I'm running Ingenious Hunter and Cosmic Insight alongside Exhaust. And we're basically just playing, like, heal the AD carry, essentially, because a lot of AD carries are... Um, they're also running their own exhaust now, which makes them hard to kill. Then if you can, you know, have your own moonstone and, you know, your own exhaust, you can make them impossible to kill. Uh, exhaust keeps you safe in lane versus a lot of these, like, laner bully-type champions. Things like Gangplank, obviously. Keeps you a little bit safe versus Fiora. It won't keep you completely safe versus Fiora because of her ultimate and her ability to just run you down. But it will help quite a bit. I'm gonna maybe pop all three on cannons. I'm not sure. I want to play the D-Mat, but we'll see. But you can keep your AD carry in your backline like super healthy. And Singe is one of the best Moonstone users in the entire game. Obviously outside of the support role, I should specify, outside of the support role, Singe is one of the best Moonstone users because of poison troll keeping him in combat perpetually as long as you're hitting somebody, meaning that you'll be able to get a lot of value off of Moonstone if you play it right. And just poison in to the enemy team, walk back to your carry, rinse and repeat. Nice little dodge there. I'm gonna use Q on the wave. He's taking a lot of damage from the wave here, though. Is it a kill? Oh, he has time warp. Wait, wait, wait. Yes! Let's go, dude! Minion aggro! Got me the kill, baby. Oh, he wanted that freeze so badly. Oh, shit. I have exhaust in 10. Can I survive? Oh, I can actually live this, I think. Oh, I can actually live this, I think. Oh my god, I did live that. Holy crap. I'm going back for the plate, dude. 
Come on, come on, come on! Yes! Oh my god! Okay, I have exhaust here. I'm coming back around, buddy. Oh, I got the assist! Hell yeah, bro. Oh shit. You know, let's hop on. Oh! No way! God, exhaust top lane is actually so goaded, man. Oh my god. That that is something, man. That is something. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> I I can't believe that just happened. That is actually hilarious. Um wow. That is really funny. Okay, yeah, like I was saying, you're just kind of trying to keep your keep your AD carries and your and your backliners alive. You're, you're trying to have it as uh, <laughs> as high of impact as possible with uh, as few items as possible is the idea. Now I have toyed around with doing uh, demonic first with this, and I do like that a lot. But I want to test it out with uh, Rylaise first because Rylaise is 400 gold cheaper. You know, you see, you save 400 gold, get a lot of value that way. What you doing, gangplank? Oh, he's clearing, okay. But yeah, you, you, you save 400 gold, you get your Moonstone 400 gold faster, then you third item into a uh, Demonic. Now, uh, obviously you're gonna do a lot less damage this way, but we're also not really playing for damage, we're kind of just playing for team fight uh, protection of the of the backline, so. Can we just dive this? Ooh, he's low. Garen's low. Nice. Very, very nice. And you yoink that out. Yoink that cannon, though. And yeah, we're essentially just playing to, like, protect our, uh, to protect our teammates. Like, if I had Moonstone right there, he would have actually lived. If he walks up for this, I can kill. Let's see, though. Ah, well, it's down. Maybe not now. Okay. Let's back it up here. Talon will hold top. I can maybe actually just go top and gank him as well. I don't want to recall. Now he's recalling. Okay. This work towards Moonstone. Uh, I think I just run top here instead of... Uh, no, we'll clear one wave and then rotate. Yeah, that's how we should do it. Because top is such a low impact role. You know, you see people running like Smite Janna and Pro Play. Uh, exhaust Ghost Graves top lane and Pro Play. It's actually where I got this Exhaust Ghost idea from. On my way was I saw the pro play game of someone running Exhaust Ghost Graves. I forgot exactly who it was or what region it was, but I was like, that's a good idea. Because that combo is good on Singed. I've ran Exhaust Ghost like way in the past. I'm talking like season three, four. I used to do that. Not so much anymore, but I think now I can bring it back, yeah? Maybe can just catch this guy? Oh yeah. <laughs> exhaust him, get him out. I actually live the tower dive because of exhaust there. How crazy is that, man? <laughs> Certainly not not the world's happiest gangplank right now. He's getting screwed out of a lot of kills because of my exhaust. It's quite fun. So just kind of taking inspiration from the meta because Singe is so flexible, being able to like do different things, I think. Helps out quite a bit in metas like this. Oh, you do not get me here, Gangplank. No way, Jose. If your name's Jose, I'm sorry, I love you. Um, it's just a joke. It's a figure of speech, you know what I mean? Do I back? Jinx might have Rocket. I think I just back here and don't greed. But it's not a Minish Cap 1 video if I don't greed. So I think we just greed. And I will back right on their vision. Here comes the Jinx Rocket. Nope, I'm a gamer. I am a gamer. Okay, Moonstone, Moonstone. Keep building towards it. I could have waited five gold for the Fairy Charm, but that's eh, really not gonna make that much of a difference at all. Did they actually kill him here? 
Nice, decent, 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 decent. Very good, very good. I hear you. Okay, looking good. And once I have Moonstone, you guys will see like you can't TP bot. I guess you could TP if they tower dive on the tower and you happen to have TP, but like you can't really TP bot until 14. So it's like. Oh, he messed up his barrel. Very nice for us. He got uh, passive on me for damage, so whatever. Yeah, it looks like. I mean, Caitlyn's getting camped really hard this game. We'll make her unkillable eventually, though, between Lulu and Moonstone Singed. We will make her really hard to kill. So that should be good to look forward to this game. To seek or not to seek. <laughs> Just flash one second. Hate to see it, bro. What an unfortunate way to go. I flank gank the Garen here. On my way. Coming, buddy. I think we got him though. Nice, very nice. Hey, that works. I take little minions here. Does that Jinx have Gale Force? He does have Gale Force. I'll let them farm on mid plates. Jinx is gonna be scary. But I think outside of that we should be mostly fine. We'll take an into one here. Oh man. Alright, Lily, let's see what you got. Very nice. We do take those shutdowns, and I think Talon has mid tier one. Very good. Jinx is dead. I want to go for one more wave here. I think, it'll ha I think I already have Moonstone Gold. I all oh, no, after this wave, I will. So we'll go for this. An ally has been slain. And then back in by Moonstone, we should be good to fight over dragons and. Uh, You're not getting me, bud. I think it's my word, but whatever. He has Essence Reaver. Can I fight this guy? I have Exhaust. Man, on a ward? How does he know? <laughs> Come on, Poison. Nice. I probably didn't even need a Ghost there. Oh, Exhaust. What a fun spell. What a fun spell, man. Okay, I'm kind of afraid of uh, Jinx Rocket here. I'm afraid of Echo flashing on me as well. Either is possible. I'm actually worth a shutdown. Legendary. Really high KP. Okay, Echo's mid, Jinx is bottom. I think we're good. Yeah, like, I mean, honestly, it sucks to be Caitlyn in a game like this, and I get it. I, I've sort of, you guys have probably noticed this, but I've sort of changed my mind on the plight of the AD carry. I, I used to be like, oh, AD carries are just kind of complaining. You know, I, I get it now. I changed my I changed my mind. I do get it because everything kind of just does one-shot them. My perspective, I think, was skewed or, like, um, unfair being a Singe player. I could have gotten that tower there. Uh, my perspective was skewed or maybe sort of slightly unfair as a Singe player because Singe is one of the few champions that actually cannot one-shot. Um, 80 carries very easily, so I think that altered my perspective a decent amount. Demonic third here. Oh, I should have bought a... Oh, you hate to see it. Oh, good dodge. No way they dive her, right? Yeah, I think my perspective was just really altered. Oh, my. Oh my Lilia, dude. Holy crap. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. Look at Dragon here. But I think with uh, a little bit more perspective, I have changed my mind, I think. I, I think I understand where they're coming from. I, I do think AD carries are still maybe uh, not quite as justified in that perspective but I think they're more justified compared to like what I was saying before basically uh, a lot of AD carry players feel that they just like get one shot by everything so it's like really really meaningless to play the role sometimes unless you're just giga stomping which like you know I, I I do agree with that that being said I also think that many 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 AD carry players don't position that well and then use that as an excuse as well so I think I think there's two sides to it really 
If they just push mid, I can flank this. I think they saw me there, unfortunately, but... When did that word get there? I think we just go. Oh, you're dead. Oh my. Okay, there's Moonstone popping off a little bit. Ooh, he wanted the triple barrel. He actually hit it, but he just doesn't have items. Decent, decent, decent. I put the W, they just ran away. Very nice. Let's grab this. Play Moonstone healing right there. Probably pretty decent. Eight, wait, 800? 800? That can't be right. I got like two shots off. I got more than that, actually. Because I have four stack Ingenious, and I also have um, D-Mat, so it's going to add up quite a bit. Ooh, Mr. GP wants it, man. She dies to Dot? Oh, not quite. Okay, Moonstone's popping off here, though. Healing, healing the Lily. Oh, God! <laughs> Holy crap, man. I am just a gamer. Oh, yeah, there's no way you, you kill the Caitlyn here, man. There's no way. We definitely keep you alive. Oh, he's gonna ult me though. I'm pretty certain he's gonna ult me. I'm feeling it. It's my like Moonstone healing now. 1120? Jeez. That, that's pumping up quite a bit, honestly. That's, that's more than I thought. What does Lulu have? Shrillies? Okay, so we have Shrillies and Moonstone together. I'm gonna go hold mid. Pop R for it. I have CDR off of the Moonstone and everything like that, so. Okay, we hold this. Our being down is a little unfortunate, but it could be worse, honestly. I just didn't want to like walk into the lane and have Garen one-shot me. Whoa, you walked up a little bit. I'm gonna back out here, I'm getting that's it. I'm gonna die here. Wait, no, I'm not. Yes, I am. <laughs> Echo got me, man. Oh, did she die to Jinx Rocket or Caitlyn Ult? No, she does not. Damn. Oh yeah. Oh. Nah, she actually lives here. She lives here. Oh boy. Yo, Gangplank wasn't there. I'd be mad at them about them. 1360 healing on Moonstone. 358 bonus. Not bad. Not too bad. We'll grab Tabby here. Mostly worried about the Jinx, and then I think I'll grab um, Giant Smelt as well for my upcoming Demonic Embrace. If you wanted to, you could also just go like Staff of Flowing Water here. What would that take? Yeah, we, we could do Staff. It would be a lot cheaper. And then going into Demonic 1865 for that, Demonic 2565. Um, I think I'm going to go Staff fourth, though, if it gets to that point. And and this game, Staff would be okay because I have AP Jungler, but Staff is going to really excel if you have, like, if you have AP Mid and AP Jungler as well. Like, just multiple AP Champions to juice up. And I think, did they change Staff's uh, stat line? 50 AP, heal shield power, base marine gen. They did change a little bit. I think it used to give um, health as well, or movement speed or something like that. Let's see if we can do some crazy shit here with my Lilia. Let's see. Oh, go, 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 go. We win these, buddy. We win these. Oh, we win these, buddy. I might have went a little bit too hard. I'm alive. Oh, I died to rip. <laughs> oh, God. I might have went a little bit too hard. My bad. My bad on that one. Hey, I got a lot of Moonstone healing, but... If they focused the Lily, I could have I kept her alive. That is that is my bad. Jinx is... Man, Jinx is just a champion. League of Legends, isn't she? Thousand damage for the tower, so it is what it is. This nice build looks OP. Yo, just wait, man. Just wait. Just wait. You can also skip Demonic here third and just, like, go straight tank as well. If you want to really just kind of 
1v9 heal spam. That is possible as well. Here we go. Dead man's here. We go uh, anathemas here for even more survivability. A lot of different options here, wait. Or, right? Just depending on what you need. But good value on that so far, which is good. He's not watching. Oh! Okay, my bad. The insta death. I think Jinx dies for it, though, honestly. She's gonna get one shot here. Ah, uh, the plight of the AD carry. Ooh, man, she's dead. The plight of the AD carry versus the plight of the top laner. Who is more plighted? Lily is just a raid boss right now. I need, I should I should learn that champion. She's like similar. I, I can have her as a jungle pick. Similar to Singe, yeah. What an actual monster. Oh yeah, we can Baron for sure. I guess I could do tower, but we've had to wait. Baron, I think, was the faster call. That is okay. Either way. <laughs> this is sort of the point, though, right? This is sort of the point where we're being more of a supporty play style with this. Um, yeah, as far as runes, you certainly don't have to run inspo second. Like if I run, oh, okay, no, no, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Ooh, you hate to see it. Can I save her? She ran into a into a bowling ball and maybe save it. Yeah, you can certainly run alternate rune secondary like conditioning and unflinching and stuff. But I wanted to go double item CDR. You're not killing her. Look at the Moonstone, man. Oh, he's gonna be moving speed here. See ya. Oh no, you're not getting away here. Never mind, that's slow. Holy crap, my bad. I should have flung him. I didn't think I could slow that hard. <laughs> See, that's what I'm saying. I'm used to having unflinching. I was on Moonstone healing. 2560 on the Moonstone. Oh my, oh my. At least 24 kills, what the hell? Certainly a game. Very, very nice. Do I have time to kill that big one? Cause I wanna get that crab as well. Nah. The singed struggle, man. The singed struggle. Do I back or do I, oh she's, oh God. <laughs> Wait, does she just live? Huh. Well, I guess she just lives. Very cool. Imagine how demoralizing it would be. If I was there healing her too. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Let me get in there. Oof. Oof for the homie. Can we end? Nautilus Jinx up in 7 isn't endable. Nah, probably not. We have Dragon in 50 though. I'll take uh, camps and then run down. Just to start back a bit. Sorry, I'm getting spammed right now with uh, coaching requests. I am gonna open them back up, guys, I promise. I am gonna open them back up. I just haven't had the chance to. It is coming. My uh, IRL has been very, very busy, like, for the last six months. It's kinda just how it goes sometimes. You know, that adult shit that we all hate. No one likes being an adult, man. Going in there without Lily, I mean, we can try. Mm. Well, 
I lived. Oh! I couldn't save her! I'm saving Talon, though. Okay, decent, decent, decent. Can we end past the Gangplank and Garen? Yeah, they want to be bad, man. They kind of want to try this with the with the tank setup as well. It's my Moonstone healing. 30-10. Oh my god. Oh shit. No! Oh, well, I mean, I guess he flashed for it. <laughs> my bad, man. Yeah, 30-10 healing. That is quite something. I, feel, I love that Lilia is still worth a thousand gold shutdown. What is this, man? What is this? Crazy stuff. We can probably force Baron. Yeah, I definitely do want to try this with like a, with like a hard tank setup as well. I think that has potential. For now, we'll go Chain Vest, actually, instead of Moonplate. I need the armor. I think the armor will do more work than the 5% uh, Moonplate. 40 armor when you only have plus 20 is quite a bit. It's nearly time. Give the support sent. I have 22 assists. What? That's insane. <laughs> 22 big ol' assists. I mean, they know that we're doing this. I doubt they can stop it, though. Oh my gosh, no way. How am I taking all this damage? Why me? Why me? Heal, heal Lilia, heal her. Oh my gosh. How many healing procs did I get there? 37, 30? I healed her for 700 health there. What? That is insane. <laughs> like I was saying, the one carry comp, man. Oh my, oh my. Oh my. A lot of tower damage. Oh my god. Jinx is up in the floor. I think we can end the freezer. We can end. Yeah, no way she stops us. I think it's a possibility, but I doubt it. Take my healing, Lilia. Take it. All right, thirty-eight twenty healing. Mm, I lived. I lived. I gotta check the replay because I, I got another heal proc right there at the end. I'm pretty sure I hit 4,000 healing, but I want to see. God. <laughs> what a crazy ass game. I want to see um what my total healing was. So, Let's see total healing, not that much damage obviously, but healing done 7,108. Oh my. Okay, so that's quite a bit. Oh, is it ally healing? Ally healing thirty eight eighty six. I'm not sure what the what the correct um the correct number is. is it ally healing or total healing? But I'm pretty sure my moonstone had to have been around four k because it was thirty seven thirty. I think when I checked it. Let's check it here. Let's see. What did we get? Four thousand exact. Oh man. Bonus healing and shielding 961. So can we call it 5k on the Moonstone? 5k? Sounds about right. We're, we're like 40 off, 39 off, so not that bad. Very, very, very not bad. I like it. Well, hey, hope you guys enjoyed that one. I'll be definitely trying a bit more Moonstone with like certain variations, you know, with the Demonic Moonstone, Rally's Moonstone, Moonstone Tank Build, like Exhaust Moonstone, maybe some Smite Top Moonstone. Never know, right? Possible. Um... Then I think, uh, obviously, Mandate would work great with this as well, if you like Mandate, because Mandate is also a great synergy mythic. Like, there's a lot of options right now, so very good stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed that one, so have a good day.